Toby, congratulations on another Northwest Conference Championship for the Whitworth women. Mm -hmm. uh, fourth place finish for the Whitworth men. Uh, take us back through that race first for the women's race and the men's race. Yeah, the women's race was, was great. Uh, we had a plan uh, in place and the women executed it perfectly. It couldn't have been better. Uh, Kayla Leland took the lead from the beginning, led it from wire to wire and, and was our first conference champion ever in the school's history, which was outstanding. Um, and the, the rest of the women took off conservatively and moved up through the pack as they always do and, and finished even better than we thought. We, we are hoping for about 45 points. Uh, we thought if we scored 45 points, we'd win the meet, and we scored 42. So they did a great job, and having five women in the top 13 is, is very impressive. Uh, on the men's side, we went in with a little bigger hopes, uh, hoping to be mixing it up for a conference championship. Felt we were in place after about the first mile or two, uh, but then out of the 10 guys running, half of them decided to have a good race, and half of them decided to have a bad race. And, uh, unfortunately, it was a bad time for that. So you've had a week off since mm -hmm. the conference championships. Coming up now this coming week is the uh, regional meet. Mm -hmm. What do you do with that time in between? You know, uh, a lot of people, uh, you know, peak for the conference championship and then just kind of carry that through to the regional meet. Some people peak for the regional meet, and then there are some teams that they're peaking for nationals and just kind of training through regionals as well. Uh, we're kind of in that middle of the road uh, uh, we don't peak for conference, um, but we just kind of keep training through, and, and also we don't uh, um, just train through regionals for nationals. So we're kind of getting ready because our women's team, we feel like we can, you know, get first or second, and uh, men's team, we want to finish better than we did at conference. And so we had some good practices last week. Uh, we give them a little bit more rest, but not a lot more, and uh, the workouts are a little bit different, but um, really we don't change much. So you're going down to California for the regionals. Mm -hmm. uh, what do we know about the course? This is a course that's going to be unfamiliar to nearly everybody on the team. Yeah, it's the same course we run every other year. Unfortunately, our team is fairly young. So out of the women, uh, there's two women that have run that course. Now of the men, there's two men. So four out of the 14 people have run the course, and the rest, it's going to be brand new. Uh, we've got video of the course. We've talked about the course, um, but we'll get down there on... Uh, Friday, our flight leaves at 5.15 a.m. on Friday, so we're going to get down and run the course about 10.30 on Friday morning, and we'll have the rest of the day to uh, 24 hours to recover and race it on Saturday. So we'll get a, a sense of what the course is like uh, on on Friday, and again, it's, it's not flat, um, and it's going to be warm, and uh, a lot of corners, so it's not a fast course, uh, it's going to be a, a good competitive course. And based on regional rankings, what teams are going to be in the hunt? Uh, well, on the women's side, again, CMS is ranked 6th in the nation, and we're ranked 19th in the nation, and so they've got a pretty heavy lead on us just based on those kind of uh, polls. They have a real strong team. Uh, and then behind us are Linfield, who we beat in conference, and then Colorado College, who they always surprise everyone at regionals because no one ever races them. Uh, really, uh, we did beat them at Lewis and Clark, uh, so we feel we have a little better understanding of who they are. Uh, so our women are going to race for the top two, um, you know, teams, and and top two teams automatically go to nationals. On the men's side, uh, we just need to do a lot better than we did at conference. Uh, we're ranked tenth in the region. We feel we're at least that. We feel we're probably uh, even a top seven team, and so that's what we're going to be shooting for.